Home Instead Senior Care is a UK-based business with uh, about 160 branches across the country and they have the same values and ethos that myself and Gail started out with, which is delivering high quality care. Really the inspection was a, a culmination of what we did already. Uh, it was about us letting the CQC know uh, what our values are. For me, it was about uh, delivering high quality care to our local community and really seeing the difference that we could make into people's lives for the right reasons. So we're not just going in and doing the medication, um, helping them with their personal care. We're doing other things as well to enhance their, their quality of life. How do we ensure that we deliver person-centred care? What's important and why we start this process at our induction training programme is that our staff appreciate this is not just a tick box exercise. My benchmark, particularly around the recruitment, has always been, could I let that person look after my mum and dad? And that's a fundamental basis from how we start our recruitment process because in terms of training, we can offer training programmes but I can't put compassion, um, I can't put those qualities into somebody that needs to be there right from the beginning. My name's Amy Morley, I work for Home Instead as a caregiver. So what I find really special about Home Instead is the time that you get to spend with the people that you look after. And I'm really lucky because the, well, everybody I look after is lovely. And they do try and match you up with somebody that, that you'll get on with and know that they'll get on with you as well. Well, I had collapsed at home actually, and I had to go into hospital. And from there I had gone into a care home. And it was my intention when I came out to have you know care coming to the house. They've all been good. Amy's that little bit special. She's been an absolute treasure to me because she does everything for me and she's very light-hearted about everything. Does She never has complaints. She just comes and her bright spirit actually gives you a lift too and she chats about things. So we always have a laugh, you know. We become really, really close. It's a security knowing there's somebody there that can help you out and be there for you, really. I've always approached our inspection process really positively because I see it as a real opportunity for us to learn. For us, our, our rating was outstanding, which we was absolutely delighted. Um, and I felt it a real um, honour for the, for the caregiver staff who have helped to enable us to get that rating and is a real testament to the commitment and the hard work that they go out there and do every single day for our clients and for their families. There is no sort of silver bullet uh, as to what we do. Um, doing your, your sort of person-centred care plan to make sure that everything meets the individual's service needs, their actual needs. Uh, and it's all about ensuring that the carer can deliver the best possible care. It's a team approach um, and that's what's important to getting an outstanding. My mum was cared for by Home Instead for about 18 months over the last three years. A couple of times in the past before we, we came to work with Home Instead, she had had care provision which hadn't met her needs for, for various reasons. I think the experience from the start, um, Robert and Gail came to see my mum in the care home one Sunday afternoon. Uh, the fact they both came was very encouraging and to be honest they were interviewed by my mum. <laughs> she, was, she really pushed on them to, to see what care uh, she, she would get. You know, caring for my mum was a partnership and the service they provided to my mum and to me was, was just outstanding. My vision for the, the future or the, the future landscape will be that um, health and social care colleagues hold quality at the very centre of all that they deliver, but equally in terms of commissioning that it's held at the centre so that they are commissioning services that they would want for their loved one that's built on quality as the, the structure.